so I honestly never thought I would say this, but this is B. John here, and I'm about to give Rabbit a training lesson. Okay, so this is Toho's Rabbit Factory. I know you said that you're fairly new to it and you don't mind button mashing. That's perfectly fine for this game. I'm not saying there isn't strategy behind it, but here a button mashing will be a bit more effective for you than say Marvel vs. Capcom or something like that, where there's a bunch of other variables. Alright, so, yeah, there you go. So just feel free to pick whoever you want, and then I'll just start giving you pointers on what to do and explain the games to you as we go along. Oh, you know I like her. Is it because of the hair? Yeah. Um, I wonder if Alice is in this game, because there is a rabbit character in this. Oh, yep, there she is right there. She's so cute. Um, if you press up once and then over to the right. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. And I honestly don't know what button you have to press, so just kind of... There you go. You got her. Uh, uh, bitch. I like her. She's based after a crow. Or she's modeled after a crow, basically. Yeah, this is part of like a game series called Toho, where it's like humans and demons and other things all living together. But right off the bat, you notice I'm keeping my distance from you and I'm trying to stay one step ahead of you attacking. Basically, you're gonna have to aim because I'm not gonna stay still. That's rule number one in any fight. I found some luck. If you hit somebody cornered, you can get them a couple of times. Oh, yeah. That's, that's a valid strategy. I don't know what the birds do. Yay! Ah. Good job. Just... It's gonna sound kind of confusing, but you want to be in front of them, but you don't want to be in, like, their line of attack. Like, basically, you're just trying to shoot and dodge. Yeah, there you go. Like that. Standing right next to you like that now because... No. Yeah, there you go, you're getting the hang of it. So, when you said you like puzzle games, like, what did you mean specifically? I promise this is part of your training. <laughs> You're just trying to me. No, I'm not. Uh huh. No. Uh, um, okay, so I was really super into. Okay, well, not at first. When I first got the game, I was like, what the fuck? I don't understand what the fuck is going on. I don't. I don't get it. I was so confused. And I didn't get past like like the first ten minutes of the game, and I got stuck there for like a, a year. And these games were this. And no wonder you asked me about that. <laughs> yes, I love them so much. Because once I figured it out, that figured it out. Yeah. Uh, once I figured it out, <laughs> it was a lot of fun. Like just trying to figure out what the hell was going on and like, what you had to bring over to this stupid tree thing in order to fucking like move on to the next goddamn level. Uh, okay. And then, yeah, there was Mist, and then a couple of other ones, and then Mist Exile is my favorite. Well, then you might like some of the adventure games I play, like uh, Sherlock Holmes vs. Jack the Ripper. Like, that's yeah. all it is. I'm just walking around trying to figure out, like, the next puzzle, the next clue that I need to get to the next level. That's cool. Like, I spent the better part of, like, 
three hours examining a dead body because of the puzzle that was <laughs> entwined with it. <laughs> I was really into the uh, all the Batman Arkham games. Like, those are fun. Those are fun. <sighs> okay then. And being able to sort of fly is pretty awesome. And like, I don't give a shit what anybody says. The little Lego movies are fun as hell. So much fun. Love them. I, I really like the Harry Potter one. <laughs> uh, I need to get that right now. Like, we've got uh, The Hobbit, Star Wars. Something else. I can't remember. But yes, I want the Harry Potter one so bad. Okay. Mm -hmm. Alright, so, since I've kind of got a little bit more insight on the kind of games that really get your attention, I got a little challenge for you. If you get it right, you can take home the rest of the candy. Mm -hmm. right. So there's going to be certain points where I can attack. It's your job to figure out what game mechanic is causing it. What? I already lost. Okay. What, 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 what? So, there's a way, or sorry, there's a mechanic in this game, like a rule basically, that prevents you from attacking constantly. I'm going to purposely try and exploit it for you, and it's your job to find it. Okay. Like, this is, think of this as a concentration exercise, paying attention to, like, what's going on in your enemy side of the screen, so you can kind of plan ahead. Okay. So... I'm gonna pick Saya, go because Saya is fun. <laughs> or Sakuya. Keep on getting the names mixed up. Alright. for you. Be aware that while you are controlling that character, there are things going on on the screen also, such as like my health and your health. See him? Something to do with the amount of missiles you're firing? Jesus. <laughs> um, actually, yes, it does. <laughs> yeah. yeah! It doesn't seem to be stopping you from firing said missiles. Just pay close attention to my side of the screen and you'll see it. Oh crap, wrong button. That was a mistake. <laughs> Which, by the way, don't be afraid to press other buttons. You have extra stuff that you haven't been doing yet. Like Whoa! that! <laughs> Shit! Take that! Oh, I have no idea what yeah. that was! Yeah. Get some! Do you see the... On the bottom right Dang side. Ooh. Like... On the bottom right side, you see those little card-looking icons? Oh. Yeah, that's yeah. yours. The ones on the left any. are mine. I don't have any whatever. Yeah. They're kind of like cards. Yeah, but that's what causes yeah. those things. Yeah! <laughs> Alright. Yeah. Ooh. What the hell is this? <laughs> yeah! The burning yeah. finger. <laughs> so, in order to block, you basically just hold the opposite direction that you're facing. Like, it'll look like you're walking away from me until I actually attack. See? Yeah. Pretty much. There you go. Mm -hmm. So you just bounce missiles at me from the direction that I'm going, and then yeah. Yeah. Ooh, look, I got a thingy. I'm not sure what it's gonna do. 
I'm gonna say I'm kinda curious myself. But you're getting the hang of this. Oh! Oh, I thought that was like a special move. There you go, you're starting to get the hang of it. But yeah. She's a demon of some kind. Oh, you made her cry. You're so cruel. All right. It's okay, she's happy again. She's some kind of demon. I don't Yay, know what really? though. Yeah. The wrong button. Yeah, she's a demon. Like the the maid I like, um, Sakuya, she's she's a maid for a vampire family. <laughs> and they're all like incredibly mean and yeah. strong, so <laughs> she learned how to stop time and throw knives really effectively. <laughs> That's really all, all right. I can say. <sighs> all right, so you've gotten a better concept. You know, you know how to block now. So, to get to tell you what it was that you were looking for, if you notice, like on the bottom next to those cards, were those blue balls. Yeah. Every time um, I was shooting the daggers around, it was going down. So basically, that's where your limit's at. Like, if you know they're at their last one, they're gonna throw it real fast, you know. Make them throw it. They're gonna realize, oh shit, I'm out. You can go in for that sucker punch. <laughs> they're really 